Good morning, everybody. It's a real pretty morning this morning in Southern California. And so I figured what I would do is show you all how to make the perfect fried egg. And because uh, it's breakfast, I'm hungry, and I want a perfect fried egg, and uh, why not film it? That's just how I roll. So um, enjoy the video, and uh, maybe uh, you too can uh, replicate what I'm doing, and I'm telling you, these are going to be really good. So carry on. All right. Okay, now I'm going to be serving this dish with um, some diced potatoes and red onions, and I put some pancetta in there, a little sprig of rosemary to give it some extra flavor, put some olive oil, and uh, so while we're, we got to wait for this to cook up because the eggs are going to take like at the most a minute to cook, so does that look good? It'll be really good. Alright. Okay, let's check in on our uh, potatoes and pancetta. Just about done. Doesn't that look good? Yeah. So I'm going to put those aside in a second and then I'm going to start the eggs. I want your potatoes nice and golden brown. Nice fresh rosemary in there. Put some time for my garden as well, so. Okay, now the first thing you want to do is uh, pour approximately four tablespoons of, of olive oil into a saute pan. Now, since I'm cutting the video, I didn't perfectly measure four tablespoons, but I'm going to guess to me that's about four tablespoons. And you want to get this oil really hot, okay? I'll show you the next step. Okay, now what you want to do is you want to get the oil nice and hot, but you don't want it to get scorching hot. So I got it on medium heat. When it gets nice and hot like this, and you tilt the pan this way, and you pour in an egg. And you can see right away it's starting to do the sizzle. Now what you want to do is you're going to give the egg a bath. And... That's the whole idea of the perfect fried egg, is you take oil for about 30 seconds and just pour it over the egg. You can see how I'm doing this? And what it does is it creates a film of, of egg white over the yolk. It doesn't burn the yolk. Uh, it doesn't make the yolk solidified. What it does is it just creates a nice bath of olive oil to bathe your egg and make it Perfect. Perfection indeed. I'm going to have cook for a second. Get my little pan here. So it's looking nice, beautiful. It's just about ready. And then, you just take your spoon, rub it on the other, the other side of the egg, and for about 30 seconds, you just take it out and put it in your plate. Okay, now I'm going to do another one here because um, I, uh, I like to have two eggs for breakfast. And I'm going to demonstrate again how the egg just takes a bath in this oil, this beautiful olive oil. And this just creates the perfect, perfect fried egg. What this does is it makes, it makes the egg crispy on the outside and it keeps the yolk beautiful, runny, but not too runny on the inside. So we're going to do this for about 30 seconds. You see how that works? Okay. And now I'm going to go ahead and plate it. This 
Doesn't that look beautiful? You can see. And now I'm going to put some of these uh, potatoes on there. With some rosemary. Now we're talking. All right. Look at this. Beautiful, huh? And I've got some uh, nice tomatoes from my garden. Put in some salt here. Yeah. So, there we go. Enjoy. And uh, until next time, check into John Rivera Urban Life, and I'll show you how to do another great recipe. Maybe I'll play some music for you. You never know. So that, my friends, was a terrific breakfast. Believe me, delicious. And, uh, you know, you want to see some more stuff, check back on my website, John Rivera Urban Life. And uh, I'll show you some more stuff. Good stuff. Delicious stuff. Till then, I hope you're having as great a day as I am, because I'm having a really nice day. And uh, see you all next time. All right? Goodbye.